Hi ghosties, this is my ghostie, and we finally have, well not finally because we had a turn last month, but the turn last month was literally the old return, well not old returns, well some of them were, and then some of them were old in CN, but now we are facing since the beginning of January a gacha event, and Remember in December we then had a 4k gacha event? Yeah? Yeah, it's exactly like that over here. Am I gonna complain? Not entirely because at least it's something I don't want yet again. Um, if everyone else wants these then okay. But the thing is, this dark git over here is a, a cheap recharge, a community recharge, so... Uh, I just I, I, I don't know what to say I guess so it says pure piano brings peace to the heart a blessed song is sung by children from the 4th to the 10th during the event sacred palm to get the new suit chance of devotion with new makeup recharge up to 520 exp to get the new suit Dark Raven with the animated part Mirror and Raven. So is it... Uh, by the looks of these suits though, this dark one is a great disappointment. Now you're lucky to have a person that's into gothic fashion or dark and gory stuff. When I look at this flipping suit, I'm like, nah, why? Of course, dark suits are more, like, detailed and more characteristic. When I look at this suit over here, it's like, eh, she doesn't ring any grabs for me. Even though I do love my blacks, I do love my creepies, I do love my gothic looks. But when I see this suit, it doesn't have any, like, sort of, oh, I want to have her because I can be creative with it. I have a lot of dark stuff in my wardrobe as you probably saw but it still doesn't give me the vibes of getting her because the, by the looks of her she doesn't seem to have that characteristic, she doesn't seem to be motivated in me um, to get her. So I don't know, something about that suit is putting me off completely. I think it's the fail, I think it's the dress or all of it because it doesn't show so much characteristics. You could look at the way you want to look at it, but this is how I look at it. So as I explained, I love my gothic fashion, but when I see this suit, it's like, nah, I've seen better in real, in real life, so I've seen better. This... She just reminds me of the regulars we had in our journey. She has the roses on the dress just like Black Rose. She has a cage appearing at the front of her just like Grice. She has that sunset butterfly feeling. With the feathers though, that actually reminds me of Stygian Death or Stygian Death. You know, the um, Perfilian suit. I don't know why it gives me that vibe. I just think because she's deaf... It reminds me of ravens, because ravens are surrounded by, like, well, death is surrounded by ravens, so on and so forth. The mirror thing, I'm getting tired of the mirrors, you know, there's flower mirror, there's pigeons full of mirrors. There's a lot of mirrors, so I'm like, eh, I don't care if it's animated, it's just not wowing me, but I'm not going to judge right now. I am judging, aren't I? But, you know, I'm just not going to give, like, oh, I... It's not worth it. Don't get it. Da 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 da. I need to look all the way through the items just to see if my mind changes. But from my first impression, it's like, oh, is that really it? You know, in Instagram, they made this a big issue with this dark suit. And I'm like, ooh, I see a raven. I see feathers. Oh my god, what's it gonna be? Is she gonna have wings? Da 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 da. You know, you explain. You you're expecting some nice, cute black wings. That's small. And then we was announced with this. You may like it. You may enjoy, you know, saving up your money for her. Do the hell you want. This is going to be from my first impressions of seeing that suit. Now let's go to this suit. She's just like anyone else in the Pigeon Kingdom. I have to be for real. She doesn't wow me. She reminds me of the others. 
there's so many people actually pointing out the items, well, similar items to hers in other nations we had in games. So there is like literally no extreme new fashion that they're creating. It's all the same old. So when I saw this, I'm like, oh, she's pure as white, though. I have to admit, she's really damn white. Even her skin tone has no pink or reddish shading. So that's a bit weird. It's like, but you end up having some pink shades on your legs, under your arms, under your chin. Well, yeah, under your chin, so on and so forth. But this pose right here is pure white. It's pure pale. So I'm like, wait, Nikki being like having a pinkish shade. She has no pink shade. So I don't know. The shading tends to look different, I guess. But that's just weird. In my opinion. I like the wings on the piano. I think that piano would be a creative mastermind. Because if you end up thinking about it. You have a lot of angels. Admit it. We have a lot of angels in Pigeon Kingdom. We have two wings or three wings. And then we could actually have a piano with wings. You see where I'm getting? Okay. If you end up having that recharge. You know that £10 probably more. Um... That angel suit that looks close to Ode to Glory. Ode to Glory. I don't know why people are still mentioning that suit. I think she's a, a detailed mess, in my opinion. But anyway, anyway. um, I'm just not going to judge so harsh because I do like the way this dress looks. Um, By the way, she's sitting down. I do like her little angels. I do like her hair. I do like most of her items. But the thing is, I have... No pure whites in my wardrobe, so therefore it's going to be very hard to even work with. I like the I like the details of the wings on that piano though. Like, why can't we have those same details of wings with that bloody pavilion suit? You know, the one in the time. Wait, no. I don't know with stage and death or stage and death or stage and death. I'm not too sure how to bloody pronounce it. But she's an angel with her, her wings just look like a brush stroke, you know, because it's like, with no details, no feather details, it just looks like a bloody brush stroke that they did. But it's animated, but there is no feather detail on those wings, and you put a lot of detail on these wings, and I was like, okay, but that's an ornament, you know, you have animated wings that hasn't got any feather details. So, uh, why did you end up doing that? Uh, I ended up thinking she would match with the halo. You know, something that floats above your head. Knowing you're dead. Knowing you're an angel. But then again, I ended up having that mentioned with my friends. And be like, oh, you'll have a halo when you die. I'm like, I will be a devil's worker. Because I have sinned. <laughs> anyway... But yeah, I think she would definitely suit with a halo, because I was expecting a halo, because the kids have halos, and I'm like, why is she the only one that doesn't have one? Why does the ornaments have to have one? I don't know. But you know what? We could actually be creative with this angel, because we have eternal instant. If you have eternal instant, and then you have this angel, <gasps> you could actually have the kids put into war, because eternal instant has the kids, and so does this angel suit. What's her name again? Uh, what's your name again? What's your name again? What's your name? Chant of Devotion. So I'm gonna call it Chant. Again, that is not even a name. But I like it. I like it. It's okay. It doesn't really suit the suit. Nah, it doesn't really suit. She looks like a Claire to me, so we're gonna call her Claire. You could say, oh, you've been too harsh on it. And I'm like, yeah, but this is my first impressions. I'd rather just show you my first impressions before changing my mind when we get to see them in a look throughs in our game. So, therefore, first impressions is what shows the true person at the end of the day i'm not gonna be fakery like the others anyway um the hair is a disappointment with this one the hair is a huge disappointment because i've seen hairs close to that and i swear if it doesn't come with a relaxed posed version 
I'm gonna flip. I am going to flip. Because we had a lot of blown in the hair hairs from last year. And I'm like, where is the other relaxed pose of this? You know, with Gothic Bride, she doesn't have a relaxed pose. Including her veil, it doesn't have a relaxed pose. It's just so... Uh, it's just awful. Yes, you have a relaxed pose of the dress. But what about the hair? What about the veil? What about those two things? It's like, I'm just so tired of seeing the blown hair pose and not having a relaxed pose after it. So it's just, it's so annoying. It's so annoying to have. I don't like having hair that looks blown in the wind and then the rest of the suit that isn't. You know, so that doesn't make any sense. It doesn't work with the, the physics in real life. So I like to put reality into my creation so that, you know what I'm getting at. And I swear, if she doesn't have a relaxed posed version of her hair, I'm gonna flip. I will definitely flip. I would even put my title, the worst gacha suit in the beginning of 2019, even though that's long. So I'm just gonna say the worst suit in the beginning of 2019. Boosh. But anyway, I'm just like, I'm one of those people that's picky with hairs, picky with the dress, picky, picky, bloody picky. Because when I see something that doesn't look worth it, I'm like, okay, admit, I already had a look through, I already have my opinion, therefore, screw it, I'm just gonna say, it. they're crap, they're boring, therefore, I'm done. But then again, I can't be too harsh because other people around the Love Nikki universe has different tastes and styles. And, you know, most of you don't like the suits I like, so therefore I'm like, okay, but I'm going to be very uh, very respectful. Not disrespectful, but respectful. But then again, you're watching my review, and then again, I have a different review from yours. Then again, I don't know how to end the argument. (laughs) Because, you know, people could carry on, they could carry grudges, they could do the hell they want. And I'm like, okay, you're going to be that person that holds grudges. I won't be that person to hold them with you. So therefore, have a nice life.